The annual Taste of Somo is happening this weekend in downtown Springfield. And here with everything you need to know is our friend Haley Magnus. Haley, how are you? I'm doing great. Thanks for being here. <laughs> yeah, thank you guys. So tell people if they are unfamiliar what exactly Taste of Somo is. Yeah, so Taste of Somo is a great food festival and it's a sampling event. Okay. So we've invited over 20 different restaurants that are going to come set up in Park Central Square on Saturday. And you get to come in, you purchase tasting tickets. Uh, it's ten dollars for a sheet of ten tickets, and then you exchange those tickets for all kinds of different food. So again, it's sample size. So you can go and try a little bit from Queen City Soul Kitchen. You can go try a little bit from Greek Belly. Try from Jamaica Patty. All kinds of things for just one really good meal. Yeah. yeah. Well, I was gonna yeah. say by the time you sample all these different things, You're it's gonna be, be full. a full meal yes. anyway. Oh yes. So tell us more about the vendors that are gonna be there, the restaurants. Yeah. We've got people from all over Springfield, uh, even outside of Springfield. We've got some of our newest restaurants, uh, downtown Springfield. We just got two new Mexican restaurants. They will both be there, oh, good. Uh, Cabo Spinitos and El Pariso. Uh -huh. So I they're going to be there. Those. Super yeah. awesome. We've got Arabian food. We've got Chinese food. We've got sandwiches and burgers. It's everything you can want. What is Arabian food? Uh, shawarma and falafel, fun stuff okay, like that. Okay. Yeah. Yeah, that makes sense. I think the thing I love most about this event is we talk so heavily, specifically on the show, but in general, about how strong the local food scene is. And this oh, is yeah. the best way to just go and try it all and yes. kind of get it all at yeah, once. You know especially if you're Absolutely. nervous to like go commit to yes, one. It's yeah. like, well, let's yes. try it first. I know? say that all the time because I'm a picky eater, but I married a man who loves to try new things. <laughs> <laughs> this is the perfect thing for both of us yeah. because yeah. we can go, you don't uh, have to take the risk of, oh, if I buy this, I've wasted money, time, food, if I don't like it. Yeah. No, you there get to you just go. try all yeah. kinds of things. Absolutely. Now, I know there's going to be live music as well. So yes. who can we expect with uh, on the side of that? Yeah. So we'll be kicking it off with Dallas Jones, a okay. favorite Local around favorite. here. Yes, yeah. for sure. Uh, and then we'll have Springfield Shanty Choir coming oh. around, leading everybody in some fun shanties. You can okay. grab a beer and hang out with them for a while. And <laughs> um, we'll be closing it out with DJ Alpha Gal. Okay, uh, very fun. So what's the timeline on this? We will start at 11 a.m. and we will be going until 3 p.m. Okay. There will be food, live music, beer, drinks, all of that through those whole four hours. And amazing weather, yeah. hopefully. A good yes. Saturday afternoon event. Yeah. Now, toasty, also, but very good. <laughs> <laughs> this um, event benefits a local organization, so yes. tell us about that. Yeah, so we are donating 10% of all of our profits to Ozark's Food Harvest, mm -hmm. which is an incredible organization that serves the food insecure families in southwest Missouri. So for every sheet of taste tickets you buy, a dollar will be donated to them, and that dollar actually will equal about four meals mm -hmm. through Ozark's Food Harvest. They, I love how they can basically multiply. They can take the money oh, yes. and have mm -hmm. partnerships, so it's not yes. like a dollar for dollar. It's like a dollar for a lot more. So That's more. the fantastic yeah. thing about working with an organization yeah. like that is they can do so much more with money than we possibly could. Yeah, right. absolutely. Now, do people need tickets to this event? No, nope, you can show up for free. Uh, you just have to purchase the taste tickets to participate in the sampling. Otherwise, you can show up, listen to music, uh, you can explore. We have a market that'll be there. You can buy stuff from them. Uh, all of that is basically free to experience. What you just have to pay for the taste tickets. Okay, what kind of market is it? We've got a couple different vendors, people like 4 and 7 Cocktails, which mm. I know you guys love, yeah, Mandy. Yeah, we love Mandy. Uh, we've got Fast Night Creek Farms. They'll okay. have some stuff, all kinds of things. Yeah. Okay, yeah. very good, very good. What a fun Saturday. I know, oh, yes. exactly. Yeah. Now, um, so you're with Downtown Springfield Association. Yes. So what else is coming up with you all? Because I know you've always got something on the rise. I mean, it's summer. There's always something happening downtown. Uh, you can hit up any of our great uh, bars, restaurants, breweries. They've always got live music playing, parties going on, great stuff happening. Uh, and on our side of things, we'll be heading towards the Route 66 Festival yes. and then ultimately uh, towards the end of the summer with Cider Days as we Love kick off fall. It. Yeah. yeah, okay, if people want more information about Taste of Simo, how can they get that? You can get it at tasteofsomo.com. Okay. Pretty perfect. easy. Yeah. Perfect. Yeah. We're so looking forward to yeah. this. Yes. I'm like hungry thinking about it. I know. <laughs> yeah. It's going to be awesome. a lot of fun. Awesome. Well, Haley, thanks for being here. <laughs> we appreciate it. Yeah, thank you guys.